Hi everyone. If you can't turn on memory integrity in Windows 11, then this video will show you how to fix this problem by removing incompatible drivers. When you go to device security, where you will find that under core isolation, memory integrity is turned off. When you try to enable it, the system checks for the incompatible drivers. Finally, memory integrity is enabled and you are asked to restart the system to make changes effective. But after you restart the system, again you will find that memory integrity is turned off and it is shown that your device is still vulnerable. Here is how you can fix this problem. Download auto runs from C's internals website at this link. When you launch the downloaded file, you will be asked to accept the licensing agreement. Click agree on that window. Now when auto runs is launched, go to drivers tab. Let the list of drivers be populated. Locate the driver having the red or yellow entry because of having some problems. Like in the above screenshot you can see that I have one driver which is incompatible because file not found. Once you locate the incompatible driver, right click on it and select delete. If you hesitate to delete the driver, you can instead click on the check mark next to it to disable it instead. Once you disable or delete incompatible drivers, you might need to download and install the compatible drivers. You can then try to turn on memory integrity. This time the memory integrity will remain turned on even after reboot.